What's up, Space Cadets? This is KJ48, and welcome back to my Let's Play for Imperion Galactic Survival. And what a wonderful morning, uh, seeing the sun rise. Uh, this is great. I freaking love this game. I'm just sitting here on my base. Um, I did do some farming off camera. Let me show you what I've been up to. Uh, first of all, I went ahead and altered the bridge a little bit. Okay, I took these blocks. What are they called? I took these ramp bottom A's. And I kind of put them along here. Um, I might move these lights a little bit. But this is the basic idea of the layout. And I got to take the pillars out. Uh, which is really cool. And this op it opens it up quite a bit. I honestly didn't mind the pillars too much. But I, I think it looks better like this. Also, one of you guys told me in the comments. This was such an obvious thing. I can't believe I didn't think about it. Um, why not use the windows? Instead of doing windows one by one, why not use the one by two windows? Fantastic idea. I just, I don't know. I didn't think of it. I <laughs> just did not think of it um what else do i have to show you uh stuff i made for healing okay so i made some stuff for healing that's right that's right okay so when i got back from space i was all kind of radiation poisoned and stuff my radiation uh stat was not high enough um for space uh can i show you my radiation stuff stats yeah my radiation was like seven so i put on some medium armor gave myself a radiation boost and um you know my radiation's a lot better now but i was having radiation issues now whenever you have radiation sickness you have to go into this thing right here um and it's pretty cool it's like a table and i think what it does is it cuts you open and then it like takes care of your radiation sickness probably through your blood but what it does is if you use this it actually gives you open wounds which is pretty cool in a way, because the idea is that you got cut open so it could deal with your radiation sickness. The thing is, if you had a machine that could cut you open, you'd pr the same machine would, st would sew you up. You wouldn't have a machine that just leaves a patient with, with a gaping wound in his side, <laughs> wherever. Um, so I thought that was pretty interesting. But, you know, you can get you could take care of that. Uh, I don't remember how I took care of it. I think I took care of it with bandages. You know, pretty bandages are easy to make. So I, I used this for my radiation, radiation sickness, and then I used this. I had intoxication for some reason i don't know where it came from maybe the radiation sickness gives you intoxication but i use this for intoxication and then i put a shower right here so uh anyone who flies by could see my naked butt in the shower i thought that'd be pretty cool um no nah, i just put these things wherever for now i'm gonna move them eventually um but the shower uh basically takes down your it reduces your radiation so if you get radiation sickness um i had radiation sickness i also had radiation um a certain amount of radiation in my blood. So, like I said, this gets rid of the radiation sickness, but then to get rid of the radiation itself, you want to take a shower. So that's what I did. Um, I also wrote down a list of stuff I want to sell, um, and we're going to go over that list very quickly. Um, emergency O2, right? They could buy like 500 of it, and it sells for a pretty decent amount, and it's also really cheap to make. So I got these emergency O2 generators, and it's making me... Oh, you get water from this? Wow, I didn't know that. I didn't know that. Oh, I'm also using fusion cells. You guys told me to use fusion cells. I looked into fusion cells. Um, I'm not going to get into why they're better. Just use fusion cells. They're better. Um, but in order to do fusion cells, I will get... Actually, I will get into this a little bit. Fusion cells give you double the power of the 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 the, um, uh, the power cell below it, right? So the power cell I was using was these right here. Large fuel packs. 150 kilowatts an hour. Or I don't know if that's an hour, but whatever. 150 kilowatts. These are 300 kilowatts. Okay. Now they take the same amount of promethium. The only difference is you need hydrogen bottles. Now to get hydrogen bottles, you need water. And when you have the water, you come in here. Yep, right there. Five water containers and two steel plates gives you the hydrogen bottle. So for a little bit of water and a little bit of steel, very little bit of steel, um, you're gonna double your fuel efficiency. Uh, these um. These fusion cells are legit next level awesome stuff. Okay. Uh, another thing I want to sell is um, grow plots, uh, tier two drills, EVA boosts. Um, EVA boosts only take the only part, the only problem with EVA boost is it takes g one gold ingot. Now I looked into it, I could not find anything in this game that takes gold ingots except for this. Now I'm not saying there isn't anything, but I could not find anything. The only thing I could do with gold ingots if I wanted to was make where is it right here i could make um gold coins now for one gold ingot i get five outputs of 50 credits i guess so i guess i get 250 coins i'm not really sure but whatever for that one gold ingot i can make an eva boost and the eva boost sell for like five thousand um credits 
So I'm making and selling some EVA boosts. Uh, what else? Is there anything else? Um, tier two pistols, um, or scanners, uh, dr tier two drills. Yeah, just and then the basic stuff after that. <sighs> okay, guys, what are we gonna do today? Today we are going to do building. I'm gonna. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna come over here. And I don't know exactly how I'm going to do this yet. I have an idea, but not an exact idea. Uh, I'm going to make a little elevator here, and it's going to come down to here. And then it's going to go over to here, and we're going to have some platforms here f uh, for my ships to land on. And I might actually make a ramp up here uh, as a way to get hover vessels up here as well. Um, I probably won't do the hover vessel uh, thing today. Um, I think just for today, we're just going to do the basic stuff. Oh, man, we got a busy day. All right, if you're enjoying the video, please remember to uncage that like button. Also, if you're new here, please subscribe for more daily videos. So another thing I want to do is put that down, okay? And then we're going to go like this, and there we go. All right, do we have, let's uh, show airtight blocks. We are airtight in here. Cool, cool. Not that it really matters, but um, if, this was a, if this was a planet that didn't have oxygen, that would matter, but it's not, so it doesn't. Um, okay, let's get to work. Uh, let's see if there's anything else I want to... Let's drop this off. I also made a furnace. I don't have a place for it yet. And I also made a repair station. I'm not going to put either of those down just yet. Just yet. And this is all stuff I want to sell. And there we go. We got a bunch of window blocks. Oh, also, when I was... Uh, I did a stream, all right, on this world. Um, it wasn't a lot of, like... You didn't really miss anything, obviously. I don't do I don't do important stuff like that off off camera. Uh, I don't do important stuff off camera. All right, if I'm gonna do something on stream, I'm gonna do like you know not boring stuff, but you know mundane stuff, just stuff to like get ready for a video. All right, and what I did was I put down a auto miner here. I put down an auto miner here, and I put down an auto miner here. Now I have an auto miner on on one of every deposit on this planet, and these are the key deposits: iron. Promethium, silicon, and copper. Okay. All right. Let's get to work, guys. Uh, I also want... Th I want this to be my main hub area, but this is bu building has to be almost totally redone. Oh, boy. I'm going to have to think about how I want to do that later. Um, but, yeah, I, I have some ideas for it, but that's not what today's... Oh, you know what? I forgot. Yeah, I totally forgot. I went back for a specific reason, and then I forgot what I went back for. I actually went back for the um, uh, elevator blocks. So, I think we've got some elevator blocks here. 14 is not going to be nearly enough. Um, oh, boy. I hope I have resources for this. Uh, I'm almost out of iron. I do have a little bit here. I should have enough. All right. Let's do... Um, let's just do 20 more. Okay. I, I mean, I could just go out and grab grab some for my auto miners if I, if I need to. But, I you know, I'd prefer to give them a good long time. Because anytime I go out there... If it's not, like, the max number. I figured out how much fuel I had to put in there um, in order to get the max number but not go over because the auto miners can only hold so much, right? Um, so I figured out exactly what it was. But if I go out there and it's not max, then I'm kind of wasting a little bit of time there. All right. So the elevator, the elevator come out right down here, I think. Or no, should we have it come out right here? It's pretty good. I kind of like it. Honestly, I kind of like it here. I kind of want the elevator to come out here. Um, <clears throat> so should it be exactly right there? That, I don't know. We got to plan this out. Because if we don't, we're going to be sorry. All right, so there... <clears throat> Boy, that was a hell of a coughing fit. Woo! Okay, so we got that. That's going to stay right there. We could move that over, but that was... Yeah, that's going to stay just like that. I don't see any reason to change any of this. Okay, so one, two, three. That'll go right there. Good good um so we gotta go right here and then we gotta go like so oops you're on the wrong side uh like that there we go now we go no actually we stay like nope 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 like this man there we go hello this is weird this is acting funny not really sure why oh like that and then let's do it from this side. There we go. That's much easier. All right. We want that turned around though, because that looks like the dark side. But you know what? Actually, is, no, that's not the dark side. Never mind. Never mind. All right. So you go there. You go there. You go there. And one more. Yes, one more. Okay. 
Yeah, we're getting somewhere, people. Alright, so this has got to come out at, uh, one more, like so. Um, we need the slope block, please. I wish this game had a copy rotation thing, like, um, like Seven Days to Die. That'd be cool. Uh, you know what? Before we do anything more, let's, uh, let's go ahead and go into symmetry mode. Uh, symmetry plane. No, no. Uh, yeah, symmetry plane. Yeah. Now we put that down. I forget how to do this. All right, I see what I was doing. It doesn't matter what block you have in your hands. I don't even, you don't even need a block in your hands. I didn't know that. You just got to click on the block you want it, um, where you want it. So you go to symmetry mode, and then I want it right here in the very middle. There we go. That's what I wanted. It's weird. I didn't I didn't even know symmetry mode could go on the side of blocks. I thought it always has to go in the middle of the block. I don't, I don't have a ton of experience with symmetry mode, obviously. All right, so you're going to do that. Nope, 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 nope. How about that? That doesn't work either. How about that? That was the one I was looking for. Okay, we'll bring those out. I don't know if it's. I don't know if they're supposed to come out this far, honestly, but it's okay. Um, we can always take them out later if we need to. All right. So, uh, because that end, so it's two. Yeah, that is right. You know what? Let's let's just take these out, and let's put these let's put these window blocks in fully, just to make sure we're not missing anything obvious. Six. And, oh, yep, see? See, I was missing something obvious. Uh, that might be a little tricky. I'm actually going to leave that one right there for now. Um, with the structural integrity. Actually, we can see structural integrity. There's no reason to guess. Oh, yeah. Pretty right over there. Check it out. This is what I'm, this is what I'm working with. Okay, so let's go. You know what? We got to eat anyway. So why don't we go back? Why don't we get some food, and why don't we grab the elevator blocks? We have all our elevator blocks with us. Yeah, we're having a real problem with food here. Well, not a real problem. I mean, you got food. I just have a real problem that I have to come back and get it. Um, my food should be able to come to me, right? All right, there we go. I also want to plant some more vegetables. I'm having trouble uh, with vegetables at the moment. So, the next actually, let's go check our crops really quick. Might as well. Oh, here we go. All right, you know what I'm going to do now? I'm going to, um, actually, I still have one plot left. I'm going to, uh, set up some vegetables. Because, like I said, um, I was having some problems with vegetables. Why don't we put four vegetables in here? I think that's all we're going to need, right? Um, tomatoes. What? I forget. What, do we, what can we do for tomatoes? Uh, tomatoes, pumpkins, or durians? Um, let's do durians. Or pumpkins. Uh, let me see what I got here. Pumpkins. Yeah, let's just do pumpkins. Okay, so I need purified water and nutrient solution. Purified water, please. And oh man, that's all I could make. Oh crap. Wait, did I make did I make more elevator blocks in here? Yes, thank goodness. Um okay, so I'm gonna need wood and stone dust, I believe. Right? Yes, no, maybe so. I don't know. You guys tell me. Um okay, nutrient solution and um water. There we go. All right, let's just go ahead and make 10 of that. And then um, we'll come back in a minute and I'll, I'll make the um, I'll make the plants, you know, this the what are they called? Saplings or whatever? Yeah, I'll make those off camera and put them down. Hopefully I remember. Probably won't. <laughs> All right, let's put down some elevator blocks, guys. So I'm thinking like uh, run right here. Okay. You can probably just go down the elevator and put them down as you go, but I don't know. I feel safer using my drone. Oh, you know what? This might be a problem with structural integrity, guys. I don't know. Yep, yep. It's definitely going to be a problem. All right, guys, that's what we're looking at now. Now, I did press... Look, guys, if you're wondering how I'm getting this up, by the way, I'm pressing N. N as in Nancy. All right? And then what I did was I went to connect to base. That means anything you build is going to be connected to the base. Once I did that, I went down to the bottom and I built from the bottom up. Very simple. Very simple. All right, that looks like... Is that a good spot? Uh, I'm going to go a little higher with that, actually. Um, the problem is if I take that off, is it going to collapse? I think if I take this off, I might have to take it off from the top. Why don't we do this? And that should give it some more um, structural integrity, and hopefully this doesn't collapse, because I'd like to bring this up a little bit. Mm, not too bad. Let's see if this actually is doing anything. Yes, it is. Cool. Alright. So what we're going to do is we're going to take this off. I do want this to be a little bit higher. Um, actually, quite a few blocks higher. 
So I'm thinking like that, that, that. Uh, maybe one. Uh, actually, it's pretty good where it is. <clears throat> yeah, I kind of like that. All right, so now we can take these off. Someone was saying eventually we'll have to fly through here, maybe. But the thing is, like, you need you need the, these things underneath. If I didn't have these things underneath, the thing would collapse. So it's it's not like it's... They're not there for aesthetic purposes. <laughs> um, I'll try and make them look a little better in a future video. But, you know, for now, they're just there to kind of hold things up. All right, so now we're going to do is we're going to build a little platform down here. Okay. I did turn off symmetry mode. Um, don't really need it here. Symmetry mode only really works when you know what you're building. I, I don't really know what I'm doing right now. This is kind of just um, up in the air. All right, let's turn the debug off. There we go. And let's come on over here. Uh, you know what? I wanted this to be a window, but I'm not going to put it there just yet. Because I'm not quite sure how I'm going to do it. Alright, so now we got elevator blocks that come down here. Okay. And now we just need to build this way. Alright, I'm just going to build a basic platform for now. And we will spice it up later. Um, one platform? Yeah, one platform should be good. How far is this going to be able to come out? I don't know. We're going to have to turn back on structural integrity again. Alright. Um, Alright, so what is that? That's one, two, three, four, five. That's five. Six, seven, eight. Wow. The problem is, as I build more stuff on top of this, it will get heavier. So, like, let's say if I want to, like, um, actually, let's do a little something different. There we go. So if I want to build something like this, you know, that might cause issues. Let's see what it does. Oh. Uh -oh. Yeah, it's getting redder. It's getting redder. All right, let's try this side. I think you could get one block redder. I hope. Okay. Yeah, now that now that's red. That's red as freaking hell. Um so we got to we got to do something about that. So we can do is we if you're close enough to the ground, you could just hold down the mouse button and then just come on and plant it right into the ground and boom. Structural integrity, baby. That's what I'm talking about. All right, guys, I've done quite a bit of work off camera because I'm trying to figure out how I want to do this and I think this is going to look really nice. Yeah, it doesn't really help here. I think this is going to look really nice. So I'm going to show you what I did so you don't miss out. Um, first of all, the you know how you use those, um, these long, you know, staircases? Unfortunately, and I don't know why, it's been like this for a long time. And I don't understand what the developers are doing. But there's no railings that match these stairs. Very irritating. You can make railings using these blocks right here. But the problem is I want, like, railing railings. Um, I don't think that's going to look really good out here. So um, I'm going to have to use these really steep stairs. And I don't like these really steep stairs because they're, you know, they're steeper than they need to be. Um, you know, but whatever. I guess we'll use them. It's not that big of a deal. I just, I want railings for the, for the, for the less steep stairs. The more, <clears throat> the stairs that don't make as, you know, tough of a drop there. Okay. So let me show you what I did here on the other side so you guys know exactly what I've done. All right, guys, so this is the way I'm figuring this out. See right here how the little crease thing here goes down into this corner? That's what I'm going to try and base this placement on. I've been having a lot of trouble with this. And I know it's probably easy for a lot of you guys out there, but I'm not like an intricate builder. I like build stuff that's pretty cool, but um, it's not like super intricate. So this is, um, this is not easy for me. Okay, so I think I need to go like this now. Let's bring this down there. Oh, I think that's it. Okay, we got it. Yeah, the little crease here goes down. Man, this is... I've been spending way too much time on this. Whatever. There we go. We got it. All right, let's continue. My goodness. All right, so there we go. And then we do is we come on down here and we bring the round slopes like so. And this one... Did I do this one? Oh, no, that's supposed to be a corner block. Yeah. Okay. Corner block. All right, then what we'll do is we'll put the slope right here. Okay, and then like that, and like that. We should be doing this in symmetry, in symmetry mode, but that's okay. That's okay. All right, how about that? That's looking pretty good to me. Okay, so now we want to do is let's place down some more stairs. Number six. Nope, actually that's not right. That is not right. You can see why it's not right. Okay, so that one comes out, and this one comes out. Okay, so let's grab the corner block, and I think we're looking for round corner long. 
That looks weird. That doesn't look... No, that's not the... It works the same as the other corner block. It just doesn't look... It doesn't look the same as the other corner block. So we want just a regular round corner. There we go. Alright guys, get out there and check it out. Um, did a little bit of work here and I've got myself 20 walkways. 20, uh, what are they called? Railing walkways, whatever they're called. Yeah, railing blocks. Okay. I also got a bunch of small O2 that I want to sell. I got a bunch of water. Um, with the water, uh, hydrogen bottle. Yeah, I need to make, hydro How do I make hydrogen, bo hydrogen bottles right there. Water containers. Those are water can. No, that's purified water. That's right. Okay, so purified water doesn't count as water containers. We have to remember that. So when we go get the water containers out of our water collector, we can't turn it into purified water. We gotta, we gotta save it for this. That's what it's for. Um, I thought this was the same thing as water containers. It's not the same thing. And we need that stuff to make hydrogen bottles to be able to make the fusion cells. All right. I've also got a bunch of small O2. That's gonna be stuff to sell. I need to organize my inventory at some point, man. I really do. I'm gonna throw it in here because right now this is all the stuff I'm gonna sell. And let me show you what I've done. we got to call this a video, guys. This has been going on for a while. Woo! Got a lot done today, man. I'm really happy with the way things are coming out. So that's cool. But, um, yeah. Got to gotta end it sometimes, guys. Got to end it sometimes. All right. So let's come on down here. I did put down, like, uh, standing lights. Anywhere you see a standing light, that's just a temporary thing, obviously. So, all right. So I'm thinking I have something like this. Uh, do we want glass railings? Nah, I think glass railings more of a, of an inside, you know, thing. So, we'll have the railings going along like this, and then we can't put it there because there's stupid things in the way. There we go. Um, let's put down some more of those, though. I do want you guys to be able to see. Um, yeah, whatever. You know what? We just won't put them on that side for now. I don't know how we're going to do the lights down here. We'll figure that out later. All right, so let's go ahead and go right here. And now we have uh, railing slope right. I don't know if that's supposed to be this right or the other right. Nope. Well, maybe. Yeah, it's this right. Now, do we got to put these on the outside? I forgot. I think we got to put these on the outside. You can't put them on the actual stair block. Okay, so we want left side. There we go. Now, those don't line up, which kind of sucks. So what we're going to do now is we're going to take these out. And we're going to replace them and put them on the outside. There we go. Nope, that's not it. And I gotta put them back like that. And then I would probably do this from the outside. So let's go on the outside. Ugh. The, the railings in this game. Like, can they just let us make stairs with railings? Like, wouldn't that just be easier for everyone involved? How am I supposed to put these on here? Um, I don't know. I've been working on this very hard. And um, it's not coming out exactly the way I wanted it to, but it's coming out good enough. I think it's pretty cool. Let's check it out. All right, so uh, you can't really use the railings on the stairs like I want to, because what happens is, um, first of all, you can only use the railings on the um, on these kinds of stairs. Remember, right? And the thing is, if you use the railings, right, you have to use them on the outside because this block right here. The, what they have to do is this is a very simple solution. Give us the option to make stairs with railings already attached very simple solution okay um it, and it's big on my list as a builder but anyway um yeah so like you see right here this 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 stairway right here takes up this entire block now there's nothing here where i am right now but that block is spoken for by these stairs okay so um you can't put a railing on the inside because it's being sp because the stairs are taking up this space you got to put a railing on the outside now if you put a railing on the outside, all these railings are on the outside. This block I'm in right now, all right? There's no railing over here. There's nothing over here. But this block is spoken for by that railing. So if you put a railing on the outside here, this entire block right here where I am right now is spoken for. And if it's spoken for, you can't put any other blocks here. And that leaves your stairs exposed. And I don't like that. So it did not work. Um, so what I ended up doing was I have... Here, let me just show you really... This is a really long fucking... Ooh, freaking post-commentary thing. I dropped the F-bomb too. Anyway, um, I put a regular block here. And then after that, I put slope blocks, right? And then I put uh, these half block wall pieces, I think they're called, half block wall pieces. I'll explain this at the beginning of next video as well, just so you guys know. Yeah, half, half, wall half. Okay, those are wall blocks. And then I put wall blocks right there that are um, these right here, sloped wall tops, full block. And then I have the little railing thing going down here. Um, these are made out of, you know what? 
I don't want to make this a really long end of the video. I just want to show you what I did. I will show you next video exactly how I built this. Okay. What I'll do is I'll build it on the other side and I'll show you exactly how I built it. If you want to know, thank you very much for watching. I will see you next time. And until then, take it easy.